This channel and its videos are made for a general audience. Thank you. Hello everyone, DualWorks Ryan here. Now you're probably wondering, wait, why are we in the middle of nowhere? Actually, you're not in the middle of nowhere, you're in the middle of my bed, but anyway. I am making this video because I have a few things to say and I have a surprise. And here is the surprise. Dun 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 da 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 And that didn't work. And, uh, yeah. I finally got my hands on a couple of track ma- Oh, 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 no. Sorry about that, I was worried I accidentally showed my face there, but anyway. I got a couple of Trackmaster Raouls. Finally. I have been trying to hunt these things down for months. Months. And I finally got my hands on them. Now you're probably thinking, why did I buy two? Well, one of these I'm gonna use for custom, and the other I'm just gonna keep the way it is. Now, one of them we're not gonna unbox in this video, so we'll just get rid of that one and just take it away. And we're just gonna be unboxing this one. And while I do that, before we get to the review, I'm just gonna talk about a few things that have been going on lately. Okay, let's open this. So, something that's been going on lately is there there has been a hiatus to Thomas the Tank Engine. Now, a lot of pe people think that the show is ending, but I personally don't think the show is ending. I, I think it's going to continue on after like a couple months and then everything will be back to normal. It's probably because of the sickness spreading around the world, but yeah. Personally, I don't I don't think Thomas and Friends is ending, and if it does, I will not stop making content. Just so you guys know. Okay, so here he is, Raul. Look at that face. That beautiful face. Now, if I just get rid of these for now. As you can see, Logan has coupling rods, even though he cl he's clearly not supposed to. And for some reason, one of his wheels looks like it's like a hyperglow wheel or something. And there's actually like a dumb fake wheel, like right there. I don't know if you can see that. But... So I'm going to be ripping the coupling rods off. And I'm just going to get some cardboard and put what he actually has on the side here so it's more realistic. Now, um... The reason why I wanted this model so much is because I actually wanted to do a remake of Grudge Match. I know a lot of you don't like that episode, but I personally enjoyed it. And so, once I get Cassia the Crane, I'll finally be able to do that. And just so you know, I'll, I'll just use Gina as Gabriella. So, he's a bit too long, but that's totally okay. What do you expect? It's Trackmaster. And I still think Percy is worse. Anyway, onto his rolling stock. We'll start with Emerson and this flatbed. I just kind of like that case. I think I'll keep that. So if we remove Emerson here, his wings fold down, and even though I think he's a little bit too small, uh, yeah, I like him. He's cool. Oh yeah, I'm. Oh yeah, I'm not gonna tell you what I'm gonna do with the second Emerson, but I, I'm gonna tell you that it has something to do with the latest season. This flatbed, on the other hand, uh, it's kind of. Um, eh. I'm probably gonna repaint both of the flatbeds and make them look like like realistic flatbeds and on to the coach which i think is the worst part of this pack uh, uh let me zoom in here mm. look at those people they just look horrifying yeah both of these both of the coaches are going to be repainted and i'm thinking about turning this one into henrietta uh i know it's not going to be proportional but i don't care so that's that so that's raul and emerson and overall, I really like this pack. It does have a few flaws, and I wish the coach wasn't included, and it was just a two-back, but overall, I really like this pack. And before you ask in the comments, no, I'm not going to get Gustavo or the 75th Anniversary Thomas. Actually, the 75th Anniversary Thomas is a maybe, but I'm definitely not getting Gustavo, because not only is it unproportional, but I don't really like Gustavo at all. He's just pointless. So that covers that. On to the next topic. I'm sorry that you're going to be staring at Raul this whole video, but uh, I don't feel like getting my OC out. So, another thing. The future of my channel. I'm moving on to Thomas Short Season 2, and I'm going to have the Thomas Shorts have some changes. They're still, they're still going to happen. Season 2 is going to happen. But as you know, uh, Short 20 was the longest out of all the shorts, and it was 10 minutes. 
And that's how all the Thomas shorts are going to be from now on. And also, I'm going to be putting more effort into the audio and the actual story. It's not just going to be like, oh, a little skit like, okay, let's do this. Okay, that's over. So from now on, it's going to focus on an actual plot, and it's going to, and it's going to include more characters, and it's not just going to be like a little skit. Don't worry, I'll still do, I'll still do skits in my I Was Bored videos, but I want to make the Thomas shorts into like my own creative series. And they're not going to take place in my universe anymore. From now on, the Thomas shorts are going to take place in the actual Thomas and Friends series. So, that covers that. Okay, and the final thing I'm going to mention in this video is my 300 subscriber special. Now, when I announced the winners of the Thomas shorts contest, everyone was focused on the Thomas shorts contest and only two people voted for the 300 subscriber special. So this time, I want the comments to be all about that. So, if you want to vote on the 300 subscriber special, then all you need to do is post your vote in a reply to the comment I put on this video. And here are your options again. The first option is a railway series story about Salty and how he first came to Sodor. And it's like a rewrite because I'm not a fan of the season 6 episode. The second option is a movie about how Thomas... Percy, James, and Gordon all end up in this scary place, which looks kind of like the scrapyard, and then they try to escape, but they run into some enemies along the way. So that's the second option. And the third option is a, is a movie. It's, it's more going to be like a special, but it's going to be Edward Strikes Out. And what it'll be, it'll be explaining why Edward acted the way he did in the original episode, and... Sharon Miller's gonna be a villain in it. And that's the third option. So, post your votes in the comments below, and I'll give you one week's time, and then at the end of the week, whichever one has the most votes will be my 300 subscriber special. And one more thing I forgot to mention. My Thomas and the Forest Engines episode, apparently you guys really liked it, so I might do more of those in the future. I might. No promises. So I'm thinking about doing a few more of the bad episodes, maybe some adaptions of the good episodes. Uh, if some of them are too hard, then I won't do them, but anyway. I hope you're looking forward to those. And, for, and I'm trying to make my channel more, more of a channel which, with, apps, with actual projects. It's not just going to be like a little skit like, okay this, okay that. I want to put actual more effort into my videos. So I'll still be doing remakes and I was bored videos and the little skits and doodads and all that. But I want my channel to focus on actual projects from now on. I, I want my channel to have actual effort to put into it because... I'm, I'm hoping to hit my 1,000 subscriber uh, mark very soon, but probably not until next year. Because the thing is, the re reason why I really want to get 1,000 subscribers is because, well, I kind of want to do a live stream and my uh, thing, I mean my, what is, whatever you call it, my YouTube studio won't let me do a live stream until I get to 1,000 subscribers. So that'll be my 100 subscriber special, a live stream. So, that covers that, and I think that's about it. I have nothing else to say, but goodbye, everyone.